true. Uh, I'm just groggy, that's all. I sent out the tweet. Hello, hello, my peoples. This is Diabolus Prime, a Florida of the Underworld, and Master of the Steamworks. And today is me and Sab's weekly Monster Hunter stream. Since we completed the story, all we're doing is farming, like, monsters so I can get the talismans I need, and Sab needs up his rank. It's farming. It's farming yeah. time. We need to make a number. We need to make big number go bigger. Exactly. What it, what irritates me is I don't think I know know the materials I need for my upgraded gun. Yeah, w which kind of makes me irritated. Like how uh, do, how do I how do I get the materials for my gun? <laughs> uh, I know. Awesome. I'll just look it up. For the last rank of your upgrades, like if you're at the, uh, the last rank of your upgrades, you need to unlock like a different part of the gameplay first, and I think that's unlocked like last rank or something. You know? That's because the la the last thing in the upgrade path needs anomalous materials, and the only way to unlock them is when you unlock the anomalous investigations. And I think you don't have that yet. And that's why it doesn't show up. Okay, so I need to go rank 10, got it. It should be rank 10, I'm pretty sure pretty much everything is rank 10. Ow, I bit my tongue. <laughs> Oof. I'm pretty sure everything is rank 10, more or less. Uh, so we need to get a gross hog claw plus times three and we have to fight the Magdalolo. Plus rock, alright. Because we need the Makamalo plate. We'll we'll we'll, we'll save the Makamalo later. But uh I need to figure out Hello Philip! I need to figure out which gloss I need to fight because it's a gloss claw plus. 
so far. It's that one yeti looking guy can twirl in his hands and swords. I, I like I know the monster, I just gotta figure out at which rank does those specific drop. Uh, it's probably the master rank. Let's see, what does the hunter's book say? Uh, you have a book, I have technology. You said plus a rock claw plus, right? Yes. That's uh, high rank. So just high rank? Yeah, uh, just high rank. Oh, okay. Well, this is not really fucking easy. We're just gonna come in and murder this asshole, aren't we? That kind of stuff, yeah, it's going to be like, uh, yeah, just weird. It's sad that it's, that, it, that it's just higher rank. That, that, that explains why I wasn't getting any of those drops when I killed it, like, three times. That's why I always look into the Hunter's Notebook to uh, check out. But Savvy, I play Yu-Gi-Oh, I can't read. That is true. <laughs> oh yeah, so, um, I know... I know you did play Magic a while ago, and I, I, I'm pretty sure I already told you about the Hasbro slash Bridge of the Coast sending the Pinkertons after people. No, I've seen that one. I just have no idea what that means. Okay, so the Pinkertons are basically like legal mercenaries that the government allowed to exist after the Prohibition area, and oh, okay. uh, ba basically they're not a good or they're a very very uh, negative. They're not a good organization whatsoever. So Wizards of the Coast sending them to this guy's house is seen as a very bad thing. So imagine this, them doing a live stream. What do you expect is going to be all in the comments from the streamers? Uh, uh, something about how the Pinkertons will come for them. So if you show us these cards, are you going to send the Pinkertons to take out our eyes? Of course, there was genuinely people asking why did they do this, and I feel bad. I feel bad for the uh, I feel bad for the people who are on stream, because obviously the guy who's sitting there running it, he's dead inside. Like they make an announcement, and he's like, "Yay!" It seems uh, like s sending a private military group after someone seems a little bit excessive. Uh, it and it wasn't even his fault. We found uh, they they accidentally sold the product early. Like nobody stole it. Yeah, yeah, the stream was very sad, yeah. And, and, and not only that, these people are trying their best to do their job and it's not working because, you know, people are wondering, okay, what the fuck has, bro? Uh, was it because why do you why do, do why do this? Why you do this? I, I mean, mean, to be fair, I mean, to be fair, if they're like, uh, uh, how do I say that? Like, nobody's gonna go to his house and just instantly murder him for opening up card packages. If he just explains the situation, then everything should be fine. Oh no, the, the no, 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 no. Everything on the guy's fault, uh, on the guy's part, was perfect. Uh, it's just that Hasbro are dumbasses. Uh, it's just that Hasbro and the team are fucking dumbasses. And did I actually buy any of my ammo? Oh, wow. Past me actually stocked my ammo. We should give him a cookie. Why do you can't travel back inside? Well, I can. I'm just not allowed to. I don't know, but he's paralyzed, so, uh, get fucked, son. 
That is why I kinda like uh, this sword, honestly. Or it's rather, I mean, uh, rather it's the max. It's not a sword. Sab, we have good news. Water has joined the part. Has joined the fray. Exactly. This is your reminder that you should hydrate yourself. <laughs> yeah. I've been affiliate for, I think, about two months now, and I still have not figured out how, like, to get sound clips and everything up. Like, I need to. I... I need to. At some point, I need to look up how to do that, because, yeah, I am going to put dihydrate. You need to dehydrate or uh, dihydrate or whatever. But at some point... At some point, I want to put, like, voice clips of me and you, because that sounds funny. And we have water and a nuke! I was going to say, say the same thing. We have water joining us, and now the nuke joined us. Amazing. Also, I don't... I know those two guys will never watch the stream, but hello, water. Hello, nuke. Welcome to... Welcome to joining us in our hunt. Exactly! Just don't set each other off. That would be hilarious. Hydrogen bomb. It'll be like experimenting with the demon core all over again. Large beast here. But yeah, I like that my axe can just paralyze the enemy. It's so helpful in hunts, I feel like. Uh, it's just kind of funny that I just get here and he's already paralyzed. I'm like, okay. It's a like I'm I'm fully built for uh, this axe basically doing paralyzed damage. Nice. Well, that should be probably. That's why. That's why it paralyzes the enemies so quickly all the time. Yeah. Okay. Move the giant dinosaur so I can shoot the little beast. I mean, I I honestly don't know anything really about Pharos Beyond Death. I just know that Hilliad sucks. And him becoming a Phyrexian is probably one of the most appropriate Hilliad thing to ever come out of after of a uh... I was three feet away. How did you miss? That's a good question, Mega Man. Today we are having pork chops for dinner. I don't know what I'm. I don't know what I'm gonna cook for a side. I'm gonna look in the freezer and see if we have any veggies. have to look that one up. My culinary knowledge is not that advanced, sadly. Well, all I'm just trying to say is, like, yeah, I want to get those again. Make those. Uh, I, 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 I really love those. You just put them in water and boil them. I really 
really go well with like everything eat related. You can put like benches inside, but that's also really nice. Okay, cool. I do know either this week or next week I'm gonna make um, chicken lo mein. What sucks? Thing is, huh? What? Oh no! I did. I did. Wait, hold on. Okay, I got two of the claws. I I don't know what was going on. I was reading this wrong. My bad. Yeah, I got two of the claws. I need one more. Nice. It's going to get us, and yeah, that was like six minutes. I mean, with me, uh, I know someone's going to say if they knew exactly what was under my mask. That's your Asian cooking, your cult uh, culture appropriating, you know, the Asians, and it's like I worked at a fucking Chinese restaurant, you doofuses. It's like a voice actor thing. It's it's bad if you if you're white and you voice act, let's say like a Japanese Mexican guy, but all Japanese people are completely fine with being voice acted by a white guy. <laughs> Oh, I know the feeling. Like, where I originally come from, do you know how hot it gets over there? It gets, like, in the summer. 90 is our basic weather. Damn. I don't know how to translate for that for you in uh, German temperatures, but... Yeah. Nah, it's fine. Okay. Like, I don't know the full thing, but it, it is... That is the best I can tell. Yeah, it's cute. <laughs> yeah, we need one more gross. We need one more uh, claw, and then we need a ma macamola plate. And I'll yeah, get mine. Yeah. Uh, does it drop in master or is it drop in high? No, it's also in high. Okay, well, at least it's in high. He's still a bitch to fight. I mean, yeah, he is still a bitch to fight, but hey! We'll fight him together. And contract the explosions disease. And he's still... Like, because of... I know exactly which gem you're farming for, because I farmed for that gem. Because of farming for that gem, he's still my most hunted monster in my list of all time. Did I tell you that I uh, listened to the a new novel from 40k? No, I don't think so. Okay. Or it depends on which novel you're talking about. Because you told me about a novel a while back. It might be... Please tell me. 
Okay, um, so you know that one of the Primarchs has returned for the Loyalist side, and that would be the first Primarch, uh, Lionel Johnson. Uh, I haven't heard about it myself, but you told me about it. Okay, so he has his novel, and he... Just, just to catch you up here. So he awakes up on this planet. You know, we made jokes about this, like, everyone trying to tell him what the fuck's going on. And he's like, can you at least give me ten minutes to process everything? Well, he wakes up, finds one of his sons. Because if you remember, for, I, I, for context for the audience who's listening, for 40k, if you know what 40k is... So basically, ten thousand years ago, his planet was—he went to war against his own home planet because they fired upon him first. And Lionel Johnson—he's not a thinker. He is what we call an act first man. So we don't really know what the hell was going on on that planet. But the aftermath of this result was somebody pissed off the chaos gods. The planet was literally ripped asunder by the warp itself. And most of the people who were potentially fighting on the opposite side of our dear Primark was basically thrown into space and time, never to be heard from again, except from different points of space and time. I forgot to grab ammo. Oh, no, pierce ammo one. There it is. Well, he wakes up on this planet without no weapons, doesn't know what the fuck's going on, finds this village being attacked by a chaos demon and does what he does best. He's gonna go save those people. Well, when he does save these people, he meets one of his sons that were fighting on the opposite side during that war 10,000 years ago. And they literally call each other traitor and pull a gun out on each other, which is kind of funny. And they explain their sides of the story of what happened so it's not it's more of a misunderstanding about what the fuck was going on because the, uh, the guy named Z uh, Zebek he did not know that the planet fired on the lion first they thought that the lion abandoned the Imperium and the finest soldiers in the Imperium that they had to offer because remember the Dark Angels are the first uh, Astartes to be created they believe themselves to be the superior Astartes above all else So, they find out that there's a bunch of Chaos Space Marines camping out in a Blood Angel weapon cache. So they go there, and the Lion feels like something's sapping on his power. He's fighting good, he's slaughtering all these people with ease, but he feels like something's restricting him from fighting. So, after he finds himself a Power Sword, gives it a cool name, and kills, with his son, just kills all these Chaos Space Marines, for the last one, he goes, Okay, where the fuck is your witch? Who keeps on trying to sap my power? And the Chaos Space Marine just laughs and goes, We didn't even know you were on this planet, nor that you were back. No one's sapping your power. You're just old. Yes? I, I, I'm that, that entire confrontation of him just, Oh, nothing's sapping your power. You're just old amused me. Uh, that is kind of but uh he he's been technically in lore he's been uh running around for a bit which is obvious which is kind of obvious but he just now found out that Gilliman is still uh, that Gilliman is alive because he's been having like emotional uh trauma because all of his brothers are dead uh, he betrayed his father and his brothers, and he's trying not to betray his sons. He's trying to rebuild his uh, Astartes back from uh, back, trying to bring all the fallen together that are like you know not part of chaos, but are still being hunted down by the uh, Imperium because ooh, you traitor! Without you know people thinking of the consequences. No, nah, that's just the Imperium in general. Yeah, he also is. It bring, it, when he found out that people worship his father as a god, it brought him, it brought sickness to his stomach. Some of the planets that he rescued kind of worships him as a divine being, and he's sitting there begrudgingly going, uh -huh. he doesn't like it, but he understands why they're doing it. Man, 
because sometimes I really want the uh, sometimes I really want the Emperor of Mankind to just wake up and be like, what the fuck is going on here? I know. That would be funny. Dude, we don't even need to set a trap. Just let me cook and let me fire all my bullets. Yeah, just let me hit him with the axe. Yeah, don't worry. This guy's gonna die before... Never mind. Set the trap. Set the trap. I'm joking. I don't need to, but still, that was funny. I'm sitting there talking confident, and all of a sudden, I just get fucking wrecked. What do you mean I'm out of range? Oh, fuck! How can you die to a high range? Because it would not let me move whatsoever for some fucking reason. Like, the game would not let me move, and again, I'm wearing sunglasses and this arena's dark. So, I could not move whatsoever, and then he just, like, clapped my ass. And said, fuck you, if I'm gonna die, I'm taking you with me, bitch. Where is he? Yeah, right next to us. I do not see him. He's right in front of me. Oh, there he is. I'm blind, sir. Oh my god, I didn't finish mining him. Fuck. I don't have it. I gotta do this again. I did get a silver egg, though. I was going to cook it for breakfast, but we can sell it if necessary. I got a mega barrel bomb. Yeah. Super duper mega barrel bomb. Oh, I don't have the lottery up. Damn. Reach Hunter rank 100. No! Can't make me. I need to tell Ash, like, yeah, I read more into chapter two of Muramasa because he's been like bugging. You will be very happy about that. It, it was funny. The main character found a lost child in the woods that has directional issues. <laughs> he's like calmly roasting the poor child. It's funny.
If we're lucky, we only have to fight the Magma Molo once. I had to respond to Yuki with that. I'm sorry. I can't be hurt by the English language anymore. If I don't believe in the English language, it cannot hurt me. You can't hurt me because I can't. I can't hurt me because I can't read. Apparently Connor's in uh, Johto for Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Oh, that's pretty cool. Which I don't know if I should stream. I mean, you started streaming it, so... No, yeah, but t technically I finished most of the game. Johto is just, like, legitimately just side content. I'm still... But, uh, like, that's... I'll decide that later. I want to complete... So next week I'm going to start back with Digimon Cyber Sleuth. I want to complete that game. Uh, cause yeah, that's... That's what I wanted to say. It's like... If you have nothing else to do, you should totally stream Pokemon. But if you have something else, then... But if, it's, if there's something that you want to do more than that first. And eventually I want to, like, stream Dark Souls 1. Cause I want to make a great, nice. I want to make a great scythe build. Bitch, moved out of range. Get back here. I don't want to have to come down there. Don't make me come down there. Oh, that I have no choice. You know what? I'm gonna shoot you in the face because you made me come down here. See, I was gonna be nice and just shoot you in your arm, but when you made me come down here, now I'm shooting you in the face. Even though a lot of them, even though a lot of them I don't really want to play slash finish because playing them alone gets really, really cranky. Uh, Terraria, right? Terraria. No, Terraria I stopped playing for a while because, yes, again, alone it's pretty tough. I don't want to go through uh, millions of tries against certain sort of bosses anymore. Yeah. And keep and keep on doing everything alone is just really, really exhausting. I don't want to like do hundreds of tries against I don't know certain post moon or bosses or whatever. Uh, I was playing like Core Keeper and uh, V Rising, for example. But it's the same for those two games. Like I'm at a point where grinding is necessary. And man, like doing that alone is just. I would just farm like all those things. No, 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 no! Fuck! See, that's what got me killed the last time. You just slammed me and I got paralyzed and I couldn't do anything. He just comboed me to kill me. Wait, Sam, it's okay. We have Urza Scarlet on our team. I don't know who that is. 
Oh. You, you have not watched Fairy Tale then? Oh, Fairy Tale? No, I haven't watched it. Ur Urza Scarlet is a very popular waifu from Fairy Tale. She's the redhead. Mm, okay, I see. Uh, her magic ability is she, like, pulls uh, weapons and armor sets from out of, like, a magical dimension and uses them as... And uses them. Magical dimension also known as your ass. <laughs> exactly. She pulls weapons out of her ass. But she's, like, really popular with the fandom. Is it because she has boobs? Yes. She has boobs, but she's also, like, the big sister of the group, slash, tough woman that you, and all this and that. Why did you plant a bomb? It's not asleep! Basically. It's a lot of dull grinding and I don't want to do it alone either. Come on, I'm just walking back and forth to the same places over and over again millions of times. I have good news and bad news. What is it? Good news is I have all the claws I need. The bad news is we gotta fight the Magamolo. Nah, the Magamolo is not bad. It's just that, his, that the specific item that uh, crystal is just the real one. That's why I kind of stopped playing uh, E Rising and Goalkeeper right now. Makes sense. Uh, I'm playing Star Rail, but Star Rail has the same has a has the problem where it's like story is done. <laughs> like for now, the, there is no more story. <laughs> So it's basically just from this point onward, it's also just dull and daily grinding. Ah. I'm just as you guys, I'm also playing like Pokemon Fusion, but that's good. Uh, like I work on that one slowly. Today I played mostly Monster Hunter because I felt like Monster Hunter grinding. My, uh, uh, Pokemon Infinite Fusion is just like PSO2 again. We're you know, only a few of us start, and then we quit for like a couple of months, then everyone's like, yeah, we want to play! Uh, yeah. Pretty much. And I like playing Pokemon games in general anyway, so why not? I'm still waiting on that Pokemon game where they allow you to date Cynthia. If not, I will make one eventually. In the year 2020 never. Honestly, I could probably make a game where I can do that. <laughs> I think I have enough game development. 
development knowledge and tools and whatnot to be able to pull it off. Nice. Don't expect any high quality things, but I can promise. <laughs> Eh, don't worry, I have low expectations, so I'm usually happy with everything. I say this now, but when the Transformers movie comes out and it turns out to be a major disappointment, you know I'm probably going to be in bed crying for about a week. Transformers movie will most likely be... okay. Wait, what? Quest Abandoned? Wait, Quest Abandoned. Me to come. No. Depart already? Yeah, I departed already. Wait, what happened? Why am I not coming with you then? Good question. Do you need me to come back? Yes. Ah, there you are. I arrived. Nice. But yeah, at the same time, I'm also looking for to play right now, something not necessarily new, but something that I feel like that I want to play. Yeah. The thing is, the only feeling that I have right now is I, is I want to play something different. But what that something different is, is I don't know yet. It's one of those things where it's like, I know what I want to do the moment I see it. <laughs> well, my manic episode... Today I started reading uh, the light uh, visual novel, and then I got tired, and then my cat slept. Uh, God decided to go. I'm going to use you as a nest now, and then I'm like, I sleep. I used to play a lot of visual novels in the past, but nowadays it's just I don't care anymore. <laughs> my problem is it's hard to keep my attention span. <laughs> I like what I'm reading. It's just hard to keep my attention span. I think it's more likely the thing of like it takes a lot to get my attention in the first place <laughs> it's like if I'm not if you don't cat, uh, if you don't capture me, uh, like not you but I guess it's just writers in general if a writer in general just doesn't catch my interest with their story in the first five seconds I will already do not care God damn it, I just arrived and it's already moving. That means just run away from you. Didn't it run away from you though? <laughs> you were hitting it in the head. I mean, I was hitting it, but the moment you arrived, it was like, man, fuck that, I'm out of here. Fair. America guns and dudes. You know, in my country, they call this the the, the great hoedown. That that is about as close as a fucking Texas accent you're gonna get from me. Trust me, I can't do accents at all. Call me back when my southern accent kicks in. I think I only heard it once in my life where someone was like, Hey, you can make that voice pretty well. Hey, you're a great voice actor. We have many skits where you're a great voice actor. 
though it wasn't like you're a good voice actor, it was just, oh hey, you, you, the, the voice you just made sounds, it sounded like some, I don't know, paragraph or cut it was. Oh fuck, he's after me. He said he got tired of my American ways. I hate that move from him so much. Ah, yep, seen that coming. Don't die. Dying is bad. Ah. When did I run out of? I wish I could just automatically ride the flying bird so I could have a mount to get there. I mean, you can switch your... You can switch your cat with the dog, or you, have, or you can find the... Uh, you know, the, the quest, yeah. The sub, uh, sub camp over there. In the mountains. In the mountains. Then we find a secret tunnel. Secret tunnel. Okay, I'm done. These days I gotta get like some soundproofing plates to put on my window. I mean, I don't know, I don't think that you're echoing or anything. No, it's just that, so I have, so I have no real window in my room. It's literally just a door, because again, this, the, the room I sleep in, slash use as an office, is not a room to be sleeping in. It is just... A spare room. Okay. So, while I have my uh, air conditioner installed, the door has to be open so you can hear like the cars and shit. It's like getting no, some soundproofing and stuff. I mean, if you have, if you need to have a door open, all the soundproofing in the world. At least I think. Slime up into a wall, slime up into a wall, slime up into a Let him go. It's such a waste of DPS. Give me your back spines, bitch. I want to break them. Well, anyone near is about to die. Ah, there we go. Okay, I deserve whatever he's about to give me. We quit fire shooting your spear at me, please. I would highly appreciate that. Why me?
Finally. Trying to throw knives at you. Yes. And I was questioning who's making that weird, those weird noises. I said I need the plate, right? Yes. You want to laugh? You want, you want a funny laugh? You got a plate? I only got, I didn't only get one plate, I got two. Oh wow, I can build two of these. Uh, but before I do, I wanna see if any parts are needed for the pier stool. Okay, so yeah, if I get rid of my expert jewel, it's not going to decrease my uh, critical eye because my critical eye is maxed out. Then that means you have too many points in critical eye. Now doing more damage. Lottery. A cuckoo plushy scarlet. I 
I guess now it's time to fight the Tigrex in high rank. But before that, I'm gonna go grab me a snack real quick. Alright. Mm. Ah, what is all going on with my voice? Oh, your voice is fine. It should be fine. Not that I remember. Uh, I don't know why I'm sitting there saying I'm gonna go grab a snack when I have a bag of fucking Reese's peanut butter cups right next to me. I had snacks today already. But I will go grab me a drink. My bones, my joints. Alright. I want to make another pierce duel. Make another pierce duel. Which means we need to kill... Tigrex and the Mazusin. The fox leviathan. You mean the bubble guy? Yeah. No. Sorry, I kind of got paused because I heard a meow and I thought Homeless was meowing at me, but she's still asleep in the room, other room. No, I'm pretty sure you heard one of the cats in the game meowing. Probably. And then my instinct is like, Precious cat daughter, what are you, what are you doing? So what I want to do when, um, at some point, is to take us fighting the final boss for a uh, sunbreak and put, like, an anime song in the background. Uh, I mean, is... Is Amatsu the final boss of sunbreak, I guess? I mean, maybe. Kinda. I mean, I would have said the guy's my boy. <laughs> That's what I was saying, the guy's my born. That guy. Yeah, we fought him. Can't kill it with fire.
I feel like my foot starting to fuck, my left foot starting to fuck with me again. I think the, uh, because of my flat feet, it, m the muscle right there is stretched again. I didn't work out for like a week. All I did was not working out for a week. That is all. And I went to the gym yesterday again, and now I'm dying. Damn. Seriously, no room to be lazy in my life. <laughs> we can never be lazy. Our target is the T Rex Dragon Wyvern guy. What does West say? T Rex. Yeah, we gotta keep, I gotta pull out its teeth. A little fun. I find that funny. Yes, I, I gotta pull out its teeth. T Grex, like, what? It's just going like that. <laughs> so, uh, in this old children's movie that I watched when I was growing up, it's called um, Quest for Camelot or The Legend of the Magic Sword. Yeah. Yeah, unironically, the main character is not Arthur. He's in it, but it, it's not Arthur. Uh, it's about uh, Lancelot's daughter. And she's trying to be in her father's footsteps to become a knight. Well, the antagonist, he basically builds robots by fusing humans with metal using a potion you got from witches. It, you know, it's, when you, it's your traditional old 90s movie. I've never heard of it, honestly. Well, anywho, the antagonist goes into a dragon area, and he, he, he basically gets these dragons killed. Now, he, in order to show what this potion did, he used it on a chicken first. So now we have a talking chicken called Blade Beak. Okay. And I am stuck in a cave. Oh, wait, hold up. Uh, nuke is back again. We have a nuke! Okay. okay, I figured out how to get out. Still feel embarrassed that I fell in a hole. But, anywho, so the chicken looks at him and goes, How do you like it? Is it be- uh, he, he explains how it tastes. And then he goes, is it better than chicken? <laughs> so the chicken's trying to replace uh, replace its food foodness with dragons, and I find it kind of amusing. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, random things just pop in my head. Turf war! I now will fight you in my true form. Take this. We got more mutuals. Yeah, when you 
play around the same time as well. I forgot to restart on regular potions. Oh well. Okay, T Rex, I deserved getting body slammed because I did that to you several times. But please stop body slam. Oh god, another, another, another Durgan shows up. No, it's Basil Goose. Wait, Basil Goose in high rank? Oh god! So, so the, the, so the music for the memes is real! Ah, uh, music. Uh, the Basil Goose theme, I thought it was just a joking meme. No, apparently it's real. I did not know this. Well, of course, where do you think the meme comes from? Bye, Basil Goose. Have fun. We'll let Nuke deal with the Basil Goose. Wow. I don't know. I don't know why he was. Nuke was just sitting there fighting it. He's still fighting it. Is he lifting up boulders, or is he just shooting boulders out of his mouth? No, nah, he's like slamming his claws into the ground, which flings boulders at us. That is incredible. I am doing a lot more attack power. That's cool. That is T. Greg's existence. He he just woke up one day, found out someone ate the last bit of a cereal, and, and, and just became angry for the rest of his life. That is his backstory. Basically. Oh, he's just... He's That's lame. Oh, that is lame. People will still get an applause from because at least no one died. Yes. I didn't even die. I like the cat dancing around. Green Reaper cat. I think if you... Uh, I think the cat just does that. Like, I know. I still find it cute. Claw. 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 Was it claw or do I need the teeth? I have both. I think yeah. Like fang. Capture rewards. I got one fang. Two fang. Okay. We do not need to fight him anymore. I have my three fangs. Oh my god, I have, I have his gratitude. Crazy. Oh, is that an item you needed, or...? I don't know, I'm just... joking. It's because I got a ticket for something that I have, like, a million tickets up already. Now we need to fight the bubble guy.
I'll go eat Dango. my trip is soon, really soon. Right now it's like two months, almost two months away. It is time to farm for Ningguang's talent materials. What? I have an alarm for every time Ningguang's talent materials are available in Genshin. I haven't played Genshin in so long, it's not even funny. I haven't played Genshin in a while either. But see, you're caught up, I'm not. <laughs> I mean, I'm not really caught up either. I didn't do... Like, I'm still stuck in 3.4. I didn't do 3.5 stuff, and 3.6 is still out, and I'm most likely not going to do anything until anything major happens. I'm still at 3.2! I haven't even done none of like the Subaru story for the most part. I, I got I got to do it. another muscly girl into the game. I mean, they have never introduced a muscly girl. I mean, the closest we have yeah. is they, yeah. Yeah, she looked like muscly, I guess. She's more just a bit. Yeah. Like I said, the closest we got. No, there's some, uh, there are some rumors about like certain characters uh, coming out in the future, uh, and it's either if they uh, if they come out or um, I don't know when the new region is announced. There are some named characters that people are hoping will be coming out in the future. I got good news and bad news. Huh? I'm out of uh, Pierce 2 bullets. Yeah, so just shoot at him. He's just a high rank monster. I have Pierce 3 bullets. At least I could say this about this monster, he stays in place nine times out of ten. No. You will not heal me!
I love slicing ammo sometimes. It's fucking funny. Slicing ammo was good up like kind of a tail. I just shot it in its face, like with multiple bullets, and then it does its like paralyzing roar shit. And like in the middle of the war, they both go off, and he falls over with his face broken. I find it funny. There's always a good way to stop the bots from doing anything. Oh, he's poisoned. Yes, no, he, he had poison coming out of his mouth. I'm too tired to deal with you. Hopefully its plate can be dropped on higher rank. At least I think I can. I don't, did, did, I don't understand the Queen's English. Who do you think I am? Well, you're American. You don't understand anything. Like okay. In my defense, most Americans are dumber than me. <laughs> That's fair. I guess. And my dad spouts out German like half the time. I have its dung. Alright, I will do this. Sorry, I was looking at it. I had a text. And I was looking at it. It's fine, don't worry about it. A bunch of my family members in uh, out of state is getting ready for a vacation. My father is getting ready for a vacation too. No, well, what's funny is it's like, y'all know I make no money and y'all are like putting me in the chat. Hey, if they drag me along and pay for it, sure, I'm just going to feel bad about it.
five carry. Okay, yeah, it's in high rank. Alright. I was just double checking that I was in high rank or not. I Now eight. Go eat your tongue, go. I did. I was looking at the armors, and I'll see my armors and see if I can replace everything, because if I can get Agitator 2, that'll be funny. I'm pretty sure that was, uh, the, uh, the, those were like really early game builds where you would just stack like damage and crit stuff like Critical Eye, Attack Boost, uh, Agitator and things like that. So it was just doing a lot of damage. To be fair, I am a noob, and hitting them really hard seems to be the most effective thing to do. I mean, since uh, since unlocking new things takes a while, you always have to go with like whatever the next best upgrade is. You can get. Yep. Because if you do that, it sticks around with you for a while. So you gotta start out with just blood force and later go into like more specialized things. Like being a pure paralyzation build. I mean, pure pa paralyzation build was a pretty good like early build, and I never. I did like move away from that for a while, but since I hate. The, changing my weapons for like every single monster that I fight. I just wanted to keep like one singular weapon on me. That's why I chose to stay at the uh, Paralyzed build. 
Like I have enough, uh, I have enough levels and materials to move on from the paralyzed build, but again, that would, that would mean that I have to craft like twenty different weapons and keep them around all, at all times, and be like, oh, this guy is weak against electric. Time to get the electric, uh, electrical lightning sword, and then change to the fire one again and the ice one again, and that's pretty annoying. And unlike Common Rider, we don't have the little tokens that can instantly change your armor and weapons over to the correct element. Exactly. That would be a cool monster. That would be a cool class for Monster Hunter mechanic. I mean, I guess that is technically a little bit how Rampage decorations work. Much damage to you as possible, bitch. Because I need to break all your parts. Hello, kitty, how are you? Did we cut off its tail? Mm, I don't know. Hmm. If we did, then I didn't pay attention. Eh, oh well.
from it. Oh, the cat sitting there clapping. It's funny. Door. Yeah. Pierce up six. Nice. And just go brr. The monsters be like, why? Wealth, wraith of honor obtained? It's not showing their equipment, uh, their um, decoration slots. Huh? What? I'm trying to look for an armor that has a slot for a uh, an arm armor that has a slot for three star weapon for three. Oh wait, there we go. Never mind, I see it. I'm I'm a dumbass. Actually, be a good gauntlets to build. Well, you also have to pay attention to what skills are all are already on. The, uh, my my gauntlets fucking suck. The skill doesn't help me whatsoever because I'm not you know wielding 
a like a melee weapon. Yeah. And it has no decoration slots. Now I'm just looking for like decorate uh, monster. We're looking for um, skull. Now I'm just looking for um, gauntlet. Uh, God, braces that have uh, three star decoration slots. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Like you have to also pay attention to the what skills. skills are all yeah. Right. Yeah, but that only allows me to equip a two a level two decoration. That's a cool skill, so I will say that much. Spanish, whatever the fuck that is. Ah, oh, I know what that is, never mind. This monster I fought before the Gormagala. Uh, the Spanish Spam Brace has fr uh, fray and rapid fire. It has rapid fire up. Which. Well, no. Never mind. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah, the current equipment I have is not good. What happened? Oh, I'm just trying to remember which one I wanted to build. I found it and it's like little quick sheaf. There was something that drew me to it that I wanted to fucking use. What's devi deviation? Okay, yeah. Any stats to seem the maximum skill will not reflect the proceed anyway. Okay, well.
no, capacity jewel, increase the bug on loading capacity. Alright, that's all I can do. I do need to... Uh hey, that gives a weapon the Crusadora. What does that mean? Gradually increase infinity by continuously landing hits on foes in a short space of time. Oh, that means... Well, if you attack the enemy, like, really, really fast, you get more crit. Oh. Well, I know what I'm making. Oh, and I can't even use it! That fucking sucks. won't allow me to equip it to my rampage slot. Oh. That's dumb. Did more research into rampage decorations. Well, rampage for rampage decorations, I have to make special rampage uh, crystals. I, I made the crystal, but it won't let me equip it to my weapon. Uh, you probably don't have the slots for it. I do. It says I have a, a rampage slot. Yeah, but 
what how big is the rampage slot and how big is the crystal you made. Okay, now that is questions I don't know. Set decorations. Uh, it's just I, I guess I it can only equip level one rampage. I don't know. It can equip yeah, it can only equip level. One. Okay, I see where I fucked up. All right. limits of what rampage weapons I can uh, rampage tools I can make well that's why you have to like that, that, that is the intricacies of like creating uh, creating and equipping, uh, equipping armor basically you have to see what kind of crystals you have what kind of uh, what kind of skills your armors and armor and like your armor spot skill how many what slots are you have, what slots give, what fits where, that is like really, really intricate. Let's get into it. I hope my next gun has a better rampage slot. Normally rampage slots don't upgrade when you upgrade the weapon, but you might increase the socket on it if you do the, uh, what is it called? Well, the augmentation of the anomaly stuff. Okay. So basically, I gotta reach my, a monster, or a master, I was gonna say monster rank 10, master rank 10, got it. Yeah. Alright. What do we want to fight? Want to do Master Rank 5 quests? You can do whatever you want. <laughs> oh, we can uh, do a Master Rank 5 where we have to slay the ca uh, Camellias. Our final hunt. It's an elder dragon. Cave. Oh, we're in this area. What is this area? Oh, yeah. I'm going to this one. I'm a dumbass. I forgot to grab more bullets. God damn it. One second. I gotta go in the tent and grab Pierce one bullets. That's if it will allow me. Okay, there we go.
Jones. Looks like there's a cave. Now that I've found out about this cave, I will lose it. Which are four between Gormagala and the Camellias. We have Roxas. Yes. I find oh shit it one shot at me what the fuck
I went inside the temple. Yep. Yeah. There's like. I think there is an inside. Yeah, the, the only thing in there was like war. But I was curious because I was heading up there anyway to get my position in a high enough space so I can just start shooting in the fucking base. Tiny little secrets. And it's like a little oil, and I'm like, okay, I'll grab this real quick. They 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 got it. the perfect spot. <laughs> there we go. Nice. The Kabila said it's laughing moments. was like, what the fuck keeps attacking me from above? I was actually about to call it right there. <laughs> Got the Camillo's gem. Mercenaries have been sent. <laughs>
find it back. Welcome back. I was about to call it there before you left, but I decided to wait till you get back. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's still pretty sure done. Yeah. This has been like two hours and my eyes sort of affect me. Oh! Mostly because every time where you hunt, they decide to go dark. Yeah, for whatever reason, all the hunts are at night now. I don't know. But we find out it's like some monster like as big as the moon that's covering up the sun or some shit. That would actually be pretty cool. <laughs> that would be. Alright, I think I'm going to call it there. This has been Diabolos Prime, the 8th Lord of the Underworld, and Master Steamworks. And I appreciate you guys for stopping by and watching. I would like to think, thank Kurushiro Ryuji for the follow and Shodenert's Cat for the follow. And I hope to catch you guys next time. Ciao. And the guys are in the background just clapping. <laughs> oh, hey, would you look at that? Your muscle rank eight. Oh, yeah, that's right. Nice. <laughs> <laughs>